Okay, thank you for joining me. Here's a short presentation of my gazebo, the Lucky Horseshoe. So join me and I'll show you some of the main features. I call it the Lucky Horseshoe because it's got this enormous teak wheel rim from an old cartwheel. It goes into the entrance. And this one is all salvaged wood material. Uh, mostly teakwood, but also a mix of rosewood and perhaps some ironwood or ebony. These are axle braces from ox carts, that is the undercarriage part. These are plow handles, very nice teak plow handles, carved, I think, to look like an elephant tusk. Nice long solid table, and then if we step over here, you can have a look at the Am I speaking too softly? If you step over here, have a look at the back rest, which is an old teak door, rosewood floor, and then a bar stand in the back. The spirit house is not included. Over here is another long bench, but with some other artifacts. Again, not included, unless uh, by request. The roof is teak shingles, and it's tin-lined. See, you can have a look. Okay. And step back, and you can see uh, the sort of sunburst design, and this is a split hub. These are routed teak trim, and then the X, the northern style design for the dwellings to ward off bad spirits or to invite good spirits. The footprint is about uh, 10 foot by uh, 10 foot or 12 foot. And you can easily see eight people with the uh, benches. So this is one of my favorites, one of the best made gazebos I've seen in all of Northern Thailand. And it's available for you in the United States. Okay, again, cartwheel rim, axle brace, teak plow handle, so water buffalo yoke, and other salvaged wood parts, teak and rosewood.